Hey guys, so I know the lighting is bad, I apologize. I'm currently in the bathroom, which is, you know, a little weird, I'm not sure. I guess you're just seeing the wall behind me, I don't know. This is my shower curtain over here, but anyway, um, my massive lamp that I use for lighting is downstairs, and with my knees being all broke and busted, I'm not going to get it, so... Um, right now I'm doing a Lush haul and y'all just will have to see these in bad lighting, so sorry. I went today and, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Redeemed a gift card I got for Christmas. So, yeah, I have a list on my phone of things I bought so that I'm not stumbling over what they are. Because I tried to film this earlier and all I could figure out was... This smells like something good, and now I have them all written down, so I got smart this time around. So first off, I have something very simple, which is just the Lush Tin for massage bars. We are missing a... This one had one in it. It's all gross. I didn't even think to open it before I bought it. I mean, it smells like Lush products, so it was probably just somebody setting one in to see how they fit, but odd. Anyway, um, we needed a tin because the massage bar Nathan bought in Italy, he didn't think to get a tin. So it's stinking up the bedroom, and he's very sensitive to smells. He can handle it for, like, the short period of time where it takes to do the massage, but after that, he doesn't want to smell anymore. So I picked up a tin for that. This one I got for my daughter. And this is the pink bath bomb. And it smells like tonka bean, neroli, and vanilla absolute. I'm not honestly a huge fan of the smell of this, but she really likes it. And I think this one smells better in the bathtub than it does like in the bag or with you. And then I got this beast, which is the experimenter. I believe this was called the experimenter it is let's see uh, has crackling popping candy vanilla and tonka absolutes and it's like supposed to turn your bath colors multiple colors over one use it smells really good it kind of honestly has a bit of like a patchouli smell to me but that's probably just me. I really like this one, and it's really cool looking. It's blue and pink and purple and yellow and goldy and white. and It just looked neat. I couldn't pass it up. And then, next. Oh, this one is freaking awesome. I don't know if this is a Valentine's thing or if this is, like, a permanent thing now. Because when I looked online, it wasn't in their, um... It was not in their Valentine's Day stuff. It was just in their regular selection. So I don't know if this is going to be a thing now. I haven't been at Lush in a while. But it's this little pink flamingo on a stick. Isn't it cute? It's so cute. So this is rosewood, ylang ylang, cocoa butter, and bergamot. Oh, and it smells so freaking good. And this is a bubble bar, so it's on the little stick. So basically, you just run the stick underneath the water and it makes bubbles for you so you can use it multiple times um, I tried to get one that wasn't like cracked because some of them were cracked looking but I love when they do things like this so I love the bubble bars on the sticks it makes it so much easier to use you don't have to like break it into pieces to use it so got one of those then I got my favorite thing out of all three things you know what I'll save that for last because it's so freaking awesome then I picked up a sex bomb Woo -woo which is jasmine, clary, sage, and ylang ylang. And this smells so freaking good. I love the smell of this. I've never actually used one of these in the bath, so that's one of the reasons why I picked it up, because I thought, A, it's really pretty, B, it smells good, and C, it's one of the bath bombs I've never done. So, you know, if you're using a gift card, you might as well go big. And then I got one of my absolute staple favorites, Favorite, 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 which is the Sakura bath bomb, and this one is my favorite, favorite scent. It's got mimosa and jasmine, and this, it just smells so good. The only downside about this one is it doesn't 
Yeah. It smells up your bathroom like you would not believe, and it's wonderful, but it doesn't leave the scent on you like some of the other ones do. So if I want the scent on me, I'll use this as a bath, and then I will, um, before I get out of the bathtub, I shower real quick with my Rub 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 Shower Scrub, because that does leave the scent on you, and it's the same scent. So I will do those together and combine them, and it's my all-time favorite Lush product of everything. Then I got a Big Bang Bubble Bar, and this is supposed to be two stars that bang together, and it's supposed to have all these little yellow dots all the way around, but this was the only one that had any yellow on it at all, and I just lost one of them. So it had like two little yellow dots there, and had one on the other side, but I just dropped it, and the stars are all smushed, but it doesn't detract from how good it smells. It smells avocado butter, grapefruit oil, and lemon myrtle oil. And oh my god, this one smells so amazing. This is probably right up there with Sakura, um, that type of smell. It's very similar, and I love it. It smells great. And that's a bubble bar, so I got a lot of bubble bars today. And then I got the cutest freaking thing, which is the Rose Jam Bubble Rune. And my rose got smushed. It doesn't look so rosy anymore. It looks smushed, but it still smells good. And this is just rose oil and rose absolute. So it just, it smells so good. It smells so good. And then my all time favorite thing I got today is the unicorn horn, which, you know, is lavender ylang ylang and neroli. And it smells amazing. So my unicorn horn. <laughs> So yeah, that is my haul. Um, like I said, you know, I had a gift card, I used it, so I might as well. I walked around the mall today and I just freaking hurt so bad after going to Lush and I was like, I really shouldn't have done this today, but I just needed to have something girly. Nathan is gone tonight at a work conference thing and he'll be gone tomorrow night for another work conference thing. So I have two nights by myself in the house, which means it's bath night because I don't want him being bothered by any of the scents or anything, and now I don't gotta worry about it because he ain't here. So that is what I will be doing tonight. I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day, and I will see you all soon. Bye!